What's up, y'all? It's your boy Jay with the playback on another video. You already know that. And today, we're going to break down that new trailer for Season 4 of Snowfall. I don't know about y'all, but I've been waiting on this for a very long time. First off, rest in peace to John Singleton. He was the actual creator slash director of this show. So, hopefully, Season 4 going to pull back through. By the list of this trailer, this show, it looks like it has gotten a lot better. All right, y'all, now let's get it. Everybody looking at me like I got something wrong with me. So as y'all can see, Franklin has a lot more power and a lot more respect. Y'all see he got people that's opening up door for him. In case y'all wondering why he's in the cane, if y'all haven't watched the show before, go watch the show because he actually ended up getting shot in season three. They left us with a cliffhanger making him think that he did, but actually he, he didn't die. He doesn't know uh cane now. But yeah, y'all see he has a lot more respect in these streets. So right here in this clip, it looks like Gustavo and Reed together. Remember, Reed is actually a um, undercover CIA agent working for the government named Teddy McDonald. But he doesn't get his cover blown. But at the end of season three, Franklin kind of figures out that he is working for the government because he has helped Franklin more than one time out of jail and a whole bunch of other trouble. But other than that, it looks like that it is him and Gustavo. Uh, at the end, him and Gustavo do become cool, so it looks like he'll be helping them work out. Remember, Gustavo never really talks to Franklin, but they do work together on the read together, so they kind of do know each other. And just like that, y'all see Franklin and Leon back at it with the whole arguing stuff. Now, there is no secret. Leon and Franklin do have their fallouts, but they are lifelong friends. Due to what happened to their other friend, Franklin had to end up shooting his other friend. Ever since then, him and Leon had a whole bunch of fallen outs, but Franklin does care for Leon. Leon does care for Franklin. But it looks like on season four, the uh, arguments had gotten even worse. So hopefully, Leon don't go out there and uh, kill him because Leon is a dang going shooter now. Y'all remember that. And here we got your boy Reed. Y'all remember Reed is an undercover CIA agent for the government. He doesn't get his cover blown by anybody else. But Franklin does suspect that he is part of the government because he has helped Franklin out of jail. So with that being said, nobody knows he's a cop, but he's actually supplying Franklin and Gustavo. Gustavo is actually a illegal immigrant. That is working for Reed. Now, Reed has taken his own risk because sometimes he went outside of his job to help these guys out. Really, he's not supposed to do all of that, like help Franklin out of jail. That one time he was in jail and helping Gustavo get him a new place and whatnot. Gustavo has been whole about the shootouts and he actually has killed people. He just has killed another undercover cop. But, of course, your boy Reed always got his back. His cover was never blown. But as, as y'all see, Franklin, at the end of season three, talks to the man Tells him he'll work for him, even though he knows that he's a cop without actually saying it. Remember, Franklin is a very smart guy. So what y'all think is next for Reed? Y'all think somebody else might find out he's a cop and try to come kill him? Because as of right now, everything is going good. Y'all see your boy Franklin got a whole lot of much power. You see what I'm saying? So obviously, everything with him and Reed is going by good. What y'all think is next for Aunt Louie? Aunt Louie is Franklin's crazy aunt. You know, everybody got him that one crazy aunt. I know I got me one. What y'all think is next for her and Jerome? Her and Jerome is actually on good terms. They had a little in and outs, but other than that, they always stuck by Franklin and whatever he had going on. Uncle Jerome, which is actually Franklin's mom's brother. Aunt Louie is just the girlfriend of Jerome, but they so close, he just calls her an aunt. With that being said, what y'all think is next for Jerome? Jerome done been through police brutality. He done seen a whole lot of murders happen. Seeing that he is older, he does help Franklin guide him towards this game. With that being said, what y'all think is next for Jerome? What y'all think his fate might be? Y'all think he might survive this next season? Now let's talk about the gang wars. This show is not based on no real life story, but it has a lot to do with what went down in real life in the late 80s and all that. This story takes place in 83. By season 4 right now, it's about like 86, 87 as of right now. Now y'all remember, crack went big in the 80s and all these gang wars start to go off. Now y'all got the Bloods and the Crips going on here. In the seasons, y'all do see the Latins and all that. What now, they don't mess with the Latins. They, they actually had to run in with the Latins. Uh, they end up killing one of uh, Franklin's people. But at the end of the day, these gang wars getting out of hand. Y'all see what Jerome had to witness and all that? Man boy end up shooting up the Bloods territory. 
And then this man you see right here, Stacy from the Wood, y'all remember him? He's actually the boyfriend of Man Boy's sister. So him and Man Boy was supposed to be cool, but uh, I guess he went ahead and had shot up his whole thing. We never even knew that Man Boy was actually a Crip until this scene, but we all know that he was a blood. So in real life, the Bloods and Crips had got wild, and like they bodies start dropping left and right. So obviously these gang wars will get worse. Let's hope that it, that it doesn't run and uh, interfere with with their Franklin's business. You do have something wrong with you. Alright y'all, let me know any other episodes y'all like for me to break down And any other TV shows y'all like for me to break down And any other movies y'all like for me to break down And hip-hop news, because I will be covering that too Alright y'all, peace